morning everyone, welcome to another vlog. We are still here in El Nido today and today we decided that we are going to have a more chill day. At least that's the plan, but I'm sure at the end of the day we'll be extremely tired again. The owner of the hostel recommended us. What's the name of the beach? I don't know, I will write it on the screen. Approximately a 15 minutes walk, so yeah, for sure we are going to be very tired. But there's supposed to be a zip line there and the main thing we wanted to do today is that we wanted to do kayaking and visit a nearby island just by ourselves with the kayak. So yeah, that's the plan for today. I didn't decide yet if I'm going to bring this camera because I'm a little bit worried about it. Yesterday it was fine because I could leave it on the boat with our tour, but now that we are on our own, I'm not sure. But for sure I'm going to bring the GoPro and have footage with that. We are here at the middle of the ocean on our kayaks. Kayak 1, kayak 2. This is team kayak professional, this is team kayak beginner. And we just came to, what's this beach? Sun. We came to Las Camanas beach and it's not a so big beach but we could rent a kayak here. And basically with the kayak we can go anywhere we want. And Seven Commando Island where we went yesterday and we really liked it. We can reach it easily with kayak, so that's what we are trying to do right now. And the water is so clear everywhere. Later I will show it to you. So yeah, that's what we are doing today. exactly sure where but we are here somewhere we were kayaking for two hours for two whole hours and we just came to the closest land that we could reach it was so so tiring well, we underestimated the length because we can see the other beach on the other side but with kayak it's really really tiring our shoulders hurt our arms hurt everything hurts Anna is dead Jonathan is dead I was like that Earlier, as soon as we just got out of the kayak, I just ran to the beach and passed out. And now we just found, it seems like it's a private island, but no one told us to go away. So we are just resting here. And later on, we will try to find some food because we have no water, no food. I feel like I'm in a movie. Someone who got lost in the ocean and just found the nearest beach and just went there and trying to survive. That's how I feel right now. But the view is so beautiful. The water is so clear, everything is beautiful. everyone I'm making this vlog a combined vlog because yesterday I didn't bring this camera so I was mostly recording with the GoPro and I don't know how much footage I got 
and today too we are just going to have a chill day not for real yesterday we were planning to have a relaxing chill day and as you could see it didn't really happen but today today is the day we are just going to walk around the city of El Nido and find some food some souvenirs check out some ferry because tomorrow we are going to Coron with a ferry and then we are just going to chill on the beach basically that's all but I wanted to talk to you about yesterday because with the GoPro I couldn't vlog that well from Las Cabanas beach we went to Seven Commando beach not really but to a beach next to that besides that and it took us two hours, two whole hours and we were extremely tired as you saw in the footage after we just got some food there was a really nice restaurant there with a really nice veggie burger and milkshake and different juice Tormix thing is and we saw the most beautiful sunset ever. This is the most beautiful sunset I've ever seen in my life for sure. Not just sunset, one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen in my life. It was so nice. Oh and by the way, one more thing. I got extreme sunburn. Lana's armpits got sunburned and her feet. Not as bad as yesterday, but it was even swollen and it's just extreme and even her armpit I'm not going to show that but believe me it's bad too I put on a little bit of makeup just to cover it up because my whole face is burning red I think you can even see through the makeup when we also have extreme muscle pain so we really need that relaxing time today Walking around El Nido tram proper, we just saw a coffee shop, so we are stopping here for a while. This is the place. This place is interesting though because we are in this market looking area of El Nido, but there are some spots like this with proper coffee shop, similar to the ones that you in a mall, so it's interesting to see it in the middle of this market area. Got the cheesecake, hazelnut ice coffee, matcha latte, it's so nice. Guys, we found the best souvenir shop in El Nido. It doesn't have a name, so I can't tell you exactly, but it's inside of the market. Definitely come and find it. It's like near... Uh, here's the ocean on the other side of these buildings. And if you come in the first street next to the ocean, you can find this souvenir shop. And there, everything here is handmade. This people are making them by themselves everything is just so beautiful very traditional looking stuff like literally really the best souvenirs you can find here instead of buying those very touristy store-bought simple stuff you should definitely find this place if you want some unique souvenirs because this is just the best look at all this handmade stuff everything is so pretty here yeah. I, this is made out of snake bone they said we got back to our hostel room, we bought a few souvenirs, we just needed to have some. In the jewelry shop, in the handmade stuff shop, Lana got so many stuff. The one they custom made for her, yes, yes, so it fits because it was originally a bracelet. And this is the other one. She got these. Oh, they are so pretty. She got these necklaces, hooks. Yeah, she got this one. We got some too with Jonathan because they are just so cool looking. This is what I got. It's very simple. I just wanted something that I can leave on my leg and wear it every single day. It's very cute. Just got a patch that I want to put on my backpack. And we got snorkeling gear because we didn't have our own with Jonathan. But here you can rent it in El Nido and I'm sure you can rent some in every tourist spot but the thing is that it doesn't really worth it because this one was so cheap we got the two for 700 pesos so 350 peso each and now we were just resting in our rooms because we got so tired it was extremely hot outside but now we are going out again because I got hungry 
And we just want to look around a bit more before we are leaving El Nido tomorrow. This is where we are going to have our dinner. I've already tried it last night and it was so good. So we came back and everyone is going to have one. This one. Mm. So good. We got our food and we asked it for takeout so we can eat it with this view. So good, it's so 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 good. Good? Dogs here are so cute and friendly, like this one. Hey you, be in the vlog. Hey hello, hello. We always have dog friends here. earlier but we heard people singing video okay so we came upstairs so we are picking some songs right now Sorry guys, it's done. That's it. 